Hi guys, I'm filming on my new camera. I look like trash. Got a new camera. Thank God it is the most perfect camera for filming videos. I wanted to do a get ready with me for work type of video. I work night shift, so it is pretty late in the day. It isn't um, sunrise, it's like 4.30 p.m. So the <laughs> sun's about to set and I have really minimal lighting right now. So I'm gonna do a quick workout and then shower and then get ready for work and I'll show you guys what I do. Let's get started. <laughs> now, I haven't worked out in a few months. <laughs> this is where I'm at with my body. I am currently 105 pounds and that's probably the heaviest that I've ever been in my life. Um, I lost a lot of my muscle in my arm and my quads. So I'm just gonna do a set of arms right now. I don't know what time is it. It is 45 or 15 till 5. So I'm probably gonna work out for 15 minutes and shower. <laughs> All right, guys. So I just finished my workout. It's about five o'clock now. I'm heading to my kitchen and I'm going to show you guys what type of protein I'm going to drink before I head into the shower. So I already made it. It's just two scoops of the Orgain Organic Protein Plant-Based Creamy Chocolate Fudge Powder. And this one is alright. It tastes a little powdery but it does taste really fudgy and chocolatey and it has 21 grams. 21 grams of protein, that's 42% in daily value. And let's drink this baby! I'm so glad that this camera has an autofocus built in and a viewfinder. I know you can't see me, I'm sorry. There you go. So it has an autofocus and a viewfinder. That's something that I didn't have in my Canon T2i that I had a long time ago. That one just, uh, it stopped working for me and it was really laggy. Um, it wasn't holding enough footage that I needed whenever I filmed. So I decided to just invest in this one. And it was a really good deal. So this is the Canon SL2. And it came with um, a deluxe kit, which means I had extra lenses, um, just like macro and micro lenses, and then some filters, a little tripod, some cleaning, a cleaning kit, and then the camera case, the battery, blah blah blah. So it came with all of that for $650. And I read reviews about this camera, it was really good. So I was like, why not for the new year? Let's get this channel to 50k subs if possible. And since it is flu season and I'm a nurse, I can't afford to be sick with the flu. Lately, I've just been taking extra vitamin C. You can't OD on it. It's water soluble and your body will flush it out naturally. Get as much vitamin C as you can. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to take a shower and I will be right back. If you're wondering where I got this sports bra, five bucks at Burlington. Obviously, TJ Maxx, Marshall, the same thing. So go to those stores if you want really good quality, affordable express press. <laughs> hey guys, I am freshened up. I got dressed into my scrubs and I just did my skincare. Whoops, getting dark. I don't do much to my face. I just do a clean base, eyebrows, mascara, and then that's basically it. Some lip balm and I'm out the door. So I'm just gonna let my air, my hair, air dry a little bit more, just because I like to decrease the amount of times I blow dry my hair as much as possible. I rarely ever do anything to my hair in general, so. Um, yeah, I actually just got it cut yesterday. Yeah, I cut off about that much. Got a medium length with some framed face layers and I've always wanted more layers to my hair so that's exactly what she did and I'm really happy. Since it's cold in Seattle and I kind of walk to work after I park, I like to wear a vest to work. Um, it's also really cold at night since I work night shift. Um, and then I'm just wearing some blue scrubs and I'm gonna wear my nursing shoes, so 
Yeah. It is about 6.15, some time has passed. I just wanted to eat a little more. Um, my camera's battery had to be charged, so I had to charge that for about 45 minutes, but I ate some oatmeal with some chia seeds and almond milk, and then drank some coffee that I made last night, and then I did my hair. I strained it, um, so this is how long my hair is now my little vanity area i just have this small little mirror no lighting in front of me which is kind of it sucks when you work night shift and have to do your makeup at night but i just use the kitchen light for um, my lighting let's just do my makeup shall we this is going to be hard i haven't filmed properly with this camera and tripod yet so this is basically my first ever test that i'm doing makeup on what I'm going to be doing first is I'm going to be powdering my face with some Cover FX Perfect Setting Powder in the light shade. And I'm just going to put this all over my face. This mixed with the foundation that I use prolongs the wear of my makeup. So. And I've seen Jackie Ina do this so many times. Um, this is actually the way that she likes to prime her face. And Goss Makeup Artist also raves about doing this technique for oily skin. So that's what I do. And then I'm gonna use my CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous in the shade 855 Soft Honey. And I have been using this foundation for a long time time I've gone through I think this is my second bottle of it um, when it came out a few years ago I feel like the coverage though has changed over the years so it's not the same full coverage that it used to be um, but it's still a really really nice foundation so for my under eyes I'm gonna go in with ColourPop in the shade medium 30 and it may look brightening at first but when it sets on the skin it darkens a little bit when it's drying down so it's not as intimidating and it is so easy to blend out it's my favorite under eye concealer at the moment just take the same cover fx powder and I'm doing this in real time, you guys. <laughs> it is like 6.25 right now. And I usually go out the door in five minutes. So next, I go in again with a Tarte brush. This is the one that came in their holiday collection. Um, and then my Smashbox contour palette. And I just take both of these shades, mix it together and then I go there around the perimeter of my face. And I totally skip on the blush. I just go straight into um, a little bit of highlight. This is the Sephora Jubilant Highlighter. On sale for like seven bucks last year. So I went ahead and bought it. It looks really peachy but it goes on very skin tone like and i just put on the lip balm and then i go on to my brows mind you guys i can't see anything right now because i don't have my glasses on i don't wear contacts to work but i am just gonna do my brows off of the camera because it's gonna take a while and then i'll be right back i just use my benefit precisely my brow pencil and then the gimme brow which I don't know if they still sell, I heard. But I'm just gonna quickly curl my lashes and then put on Essence, the False Lashes Mascara. All right guys, so this is my finished makeup look for work. I'm a little behind schedule. Um, I usually leave five minutes a bow. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm gonna go ahead and go out the door. Thanks for hanging out with me. I'll see you guys in my next video.